I'm about to introduce you to someone really special. Don't worry, you look fine. I'm about to introduce you to the person who inspired the creation of the Heart Foundation. Get ready. Hey everyone, it's Hannah with the Heart Foundation. For over 26 years, we've been advocating for the education, early detection, and prevention of heart disease, which is the number one cause of death for both women and men in the United States. We are also incredibly proud to support innovative, groundbreaking research happening at Cedar sinai under the direction of world-renowned cardiologist, Dr. P.K. Shaw. And by the way, earlier this year, Cedar sinai was named one of the top three cardiology hospitals in the country. But enough about us, I need to introduce you to Steve. Husband, father, friend to many, this is Steve Cohen. Non-drinker, non-smoker, athletic, young, vibrant. He totally looks like he would be the picture-perfect example of what it means to be healthy. I mean, look at him on his motorcycle right next to Heart Foundation Chairman Mark Littman. But when Steve was only 35 years old, he was playing basketball with a group of friends and he suffered a fatal heart attack. I'm gonna say it one more time, 35 years old. Obviously, Steve's friends and family and community were completely shocked and devastated by his passing. They never wanted anybody to feel that same sense of loss ever again, so they started a movement. And the Heart Foundation was born. This is the very first article that was ever written about us in 1997. At the time, we were called the Heart Fund. The Heart Foundation has grown a lot since that article was written in 1997, and we've donated millions of dollars to support heart disease research at Cedar sinai And now I'm here talking to all of you. I thought today would be the perfect day to introduce you to Steve and to tell you a little bit about our background because today marks 27 years without Steve Cohen. Steve was just a normal guy. He wasn't famous, he wasn't a celebrity. I never even met him, but he inspires and motivates our work every single day. If you'd like to help us honor Steve today, or if you'd like to honor someone in your life who's been touched by heart disease, please feel free to make a donation at theheartfoundation.org. As I said before, proceeds support heart disease research at Cedar sinai Let this guy be your inspiration. Thank you, Steve, for being the driving force behind everything we do. I'm Hannah with the Heart Foundation. Remember, you're never too young, and it's never too late to start living a more heart-healthy lifestyle.